hi guys in this video we are going to discuss about auto it window info tool before that we will first launch the auto it window info tool go to all programs auto it and you can find auto it window info tool just click it yeah this is an auto it window info tool with this you can able to identify the application controls and properties for example just take notepad this is a blank notepad here if you just click and drag you can find the window title info and class control info and instances let's see one by one minimize it this is a finder tool with this tool you are going to find the application windows and controls you will have to just click on it and drag and drop where you want to find the controls and properties okay and this is one title so i'm just opening notepad again i'm dragging the finder tool and put it here you can find the title and title the notepad here you can see this untitled notepad this indicate the window title and class and this untitled notepad belong to a class called notepad this is a control info control info means even an application may contain several type of controls so to identify and interact with that particular control you should get to know its properties this is a class edit we are finding the control of this text area portion so it belong to a class called the edit and it has an instance once instance one what it is uh, what is the use of instance means uh, just assume that this window notepad contains so many edit classes then for to interact with all these classes it will assign an instance starting from one two three like that so this is the use of the instance and window tab it uh, just summarize what you have seen here and apart from that it will also display the position this position indicate the mouse coordinate position and the size length and the breadth value will be shown here style x style handle handle is a window handle you will get to know this handle in the upcoming chapters controls so we are placing in this part so it display the properties and value of the control class it belong this text portion belong to the uh, class called the editor so it is showing here and it has it instance one class name it is uh, most of the time it will be similar to this class and name if it has any name it will be displayed here advanced mode um, you can uh, use this advanced mode when doing uh, writing the script id id is control id uh, no need to go for control id when writing the script because uh, most of the time this control id will be constantly changing so it is better to go with this class and instance instead of this control id and this size this is the size of this control and control click coordinate represent where we place the control it we place it here so it is showing us 165 comma 139 here it will take the coordinate starting from here taking these as an origin and showing the coordinates here style x style these are all some of the hexadecimal values no need to worry about this now go to this visible text if this control has any visible text then it will be displayed here for example i'm going to type something called check and i'm placing this finder tool here you can find the visible text will be shown here and hidden text if the developer developing during developing this notepad if he made some any assign some any text to her then it will be displayed in the hidden text and status bar status bar indicate the status of the application for example if you go to start task manager then I'm not sure yeah it's launched um, then if you place this finder tool here it will show the status process 92 cpu safe physical memory it is identify it is used to identify the status of the application and this toolbar if your application has any tool inside that then the index commands and text will be displayed here and mouse it represents the position of the mouse coordinate and the cursor id and color summary tab please describe the whole summarize of all the steps you can find the values and the properties of all the tabs here so this is the 
use of uh, auto IT window info tool. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe.